What's up team? So today we're gonna to be doing a super cool and very dangerous experiment. So I was reading online and I read this comment that said sodium hydroxide is very dangerous. Uh, you need to really take precaution when working with it. And it's so dangerous in fact, that if you put sodium hydroxide in an aluminum pot, it'll eat a hole right through it. And I was like, what? Sounds crazy. That sounds, like, that sounds like something that I should try. And so today, we're gonna to be testing how powerful sodium hydroxide is against aluminum. Okay, so we're gonna start small. We're gonna kind of work up to something a little bit bigger. So I bought all this stuff at the Goodwill. I'm a big fan of buying stuff at the Goodwill. Now I assume all these things are aluminum because they're super lightweight and they're unpolished. Usually stainless steel is polished and it's a little bit heavier. Really don't wanna screw around on this. Sodium hydroxide, very powerful stuff. Um, it's actually Drano. It's what we use to clear a drain. Uh, so it'll actually eat the right, right through your skin. So we're gonna start really small um, and we're gonna put a little bit of aluminum foil in here and then some pop tabs uh, with some sodium hydroxide. You wanna add the sodium hydroxide to the water, not the water to the sodium hydroxide. It's a big thing. Um, this this reaction is exothermic. And so what that means is it heats up quite a bit. So we're gonna go ahead and we're just gonna make a lot of it. We wanna do this slowly. Now we're just gonna put two of these in here. We're just gonna see what happens. As you can see, it's, it's going for it. Are they gone? <laughs> I don't see anything in there anymore. I think they're dissolved. Oh my gosh, they completely dissolved it. Holy crap. We got anything in the bottom there? Nope. Okay, so there we go. It literally dissolved our tops into just this sort of like off gray color. That's all we ended up with. There's nothing else in there. We can look right at the bottom. Wow, completely dissolved it. What I'd like to do is like put this halfway in there and see if it'll eat halfway through this thing. If you look in there, I mean, it is just total, like wherever, it's like the floor is lava, right? It's like the sodium hydroxide is lava. Wherever there was sodium hydroxide, there is no more aluminum foil. All right, I think it's time to step it up. Um, that has worked very well. We're gonna do this, we're gonna do this next, then here. I'm just gonna pull this thing out of there. This is a, like a really solid piece of aluminum. I'm really curious to see what actually happened, how much damage it is. Let's take a look. It really doesn't <laughs> look like much happened there. It looks like it kind of just polished it, really. It's really soft. Look at that, I can like scrape it. Look at that. There's the sodium aluminate. And it really makes me wonder how much you know, we're gonna have to add to this in order to, to get it to eat through the whole way. We really, we're gonna go ham on this one. So we're gonna, really gonna go with a lot of sodium hydroxide. All right, so we're gonna be taking this online myth, this sort of rumor, and we're gonna be putting it to the test. That's, that's kind of what we do here on the Nickypedia Show. Um, we, we, we take things that we read online and then we test them if they're actually fact or fiction. So we have this over here, we have this, uh, this bowl here, this aluminum bowl. We're gonna dump all this uh, sodium hydroxide in there. And we're really gonna test, you know, can you actually put sodium hydroxide lye water in, uh, in a in a aluminum pot, and will it really eat through the bottom of it? Uh, so we're, we're gonna find out. We have our little C stand set up here. I'm um, just gonna we're gonna, really gonna get a high concentration of this, and we're gonna put it right down there in the bottom of that uh, bowl, and we're gonna see what happens. Up. Oh. Pouring it in the wrong direction. OK. 
Okay. <laughs> Actually looks quite dangerous. Uh, it looks like it wants to go through. I mean, it is, it is working up a storm. Oh sh! Oh your camera! Oh sh! Oh, oh god. god! Oh my camera! Oh your lens! Oh, oh god. god! Bring it oh, back! God. Bring it back! Don't oh, take it back! Oh, it's coming out the side! It's coming out the side! It's true! It's true! It's coming out the side! It's true! What? Oh, right there! Look! Oh, look! The, oh, the whole thing's gonna come off. The whole, the whole bottom's gonna come undone. Look at it! You can see where the fish line is. You can oh, there see. It is where the line is there all is. the way across. Oh, it's, oh, it's going. It's going. Oh, it's happening. It's going. It's oh, going. It's Look at that ring. And it's coming up the side right there. It looks like the whole bottom wants to let go. So, oh, oh. No way! <laughs> No way did that just happen. I was just standing here talking. We were gonna add a whole bunch more sodium hydroxide and it literally just fell right off. Wow. Wow. So this is the bottom half of the bowl. Oh my God. It's like an aluminum, like Soup. putty. Like there's still some pieces that are kind of intact. But it's just like a goop. It's a sodium goop. Look how hot it got. It actually scored the top of the uh, of our of our wood right here. Wow, that reaction extremely exothermic. Okay, so myth confirmed. Online rumor confirmed. If you put sodium hydroxide or lye. Uh, dissolved into water inside of an aluminum pot, it really will eat right through the bottom of it. Now, we obviously used a lot. So we used two cups, uh, 500 milliliters of as much sodium hydroxide as we could dissolve in the water. Um, if you even use a little bit less than that and you give it more time, it probably would still eat through the bottom of it. So, online rumor confirmed. Do not mix sodium hydroxide uh, with an aluminum pot. It'll eat right through the bottom of it. If you like this video, go ahead and give us a thumbs up in the comment section below. Let me know. Were you super surprised to see how uh, uh, aggressive the sodium hydroxide was with this aluminum pot? If you haven't yet, hit that subscribe button and we'll see you really soon.